Hi ladies, it's Kara. Um, I had promised you that I was gonna vlog and uh, let you know how my, well, my transfer went. Well, it went smooth, it was quick, it was done. I mean, we were supposed to have our transfer at 10 after nine, then they called me, pushed it back to 10, 10. And then when we were there, we probably didn't get it closer to like 11 o'clock, but it was like less than five minutes and that was it. Um, nothing too crazy. Uh, I mean, there's no symptoms as of yet. There is absolutely nothing. I don't feel, I feel tired because I'm always tired and it's like raining here and it's May 1st. Um, slight cramping, nothing else really. Like I really don't feel anything at all. I'm excited. I'm super excited because, you know, finally where we wanted to be and praying for another baby, but there's nothing as of, um, one day post five day transfer to really talk about. Um, my husband's excited. He's cautiously optimistic. Our son is very excited. He's already telling, he's saying he's going to tell everybody at school, but that's a kid for you. What can you do? Um, <clears throat> that's really it. Just been taking it easy. My doctor didn't recommend bed rest. My doctor said, um, no heavy lifting. Um, day, live your day as normally. Don't do anything strenuous, which is just common sense. Um, but nothing else. So... I guess I'll have hoping I will have more to uh, tell y'all tomorrow, two days post five day transfer. God willing. Um, I mean, you always, it's like waiting the two week wait. It's brutal. But the good thing is just, you're already like five days past. So today, what you're like six days post, six days post off. And I'm going to test. Okay. So there was this girl. And um, I went to the grocery store and she had worked there and she had said to me, we were just got talking, chit chatting and she had told me things she was doing and she had said, Carmelo, please don't do that, that um, she, that I would have a baby by the time I was 37 and I was like, okay, whatever, you know, I'm like 34, 35 now and you're telling me like four, three, four years from now I'm going to get pregnant and <laughs> it's going to take me that long. Well, yeah, I'm going to 37. Um, my birthday is the 9th, which is next Monday, which is really cool because uh, she may be right. I may find out, God willing, that I am pregnant at 37. So I'm going to test on Thursday. So what's that say? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. So five days post five day transfer. And uh, I'm a piano stickaholic. So I mean, I could even test sooner. But I mean, I don't want to. But there's a good chance I will. Haha, <laughs> ha, I laugh, but it's true. Um, otherwise, yeah, wouldn't that be cool if I found that I was pregnant? when I was 37 and like turned 38 the very next day, which would be really funny. But anyways, ladies, that's all I have to really say. I'm sorry. It's been a very boring day today here and uh, the weather hasn't been any better. It's been really gloomy and somebody wants to say hi. Stella, say hi. Mm. Mama, say hi. Look. Oh, I say hello, YouTube. Yes, you're a good girl. I love you. Okay, ladies, you have a wonderful night. God bless you all. Baby dust to everybody, and we'll definitely chat tomorrow. Take care. Talk to you later. Bye for now.